Hello everyone, my name is Ryan and I developed several task widgets over the past few months or years and today I'm going to be teaching you how to install and set up this task widget. There's something different about this widget is the streamerbot version of the task widget. So why should you use the streamerbot version? Well, the only difference from the other task widgets is that it's cross-platform to YouTube. You can stream to YouTube, you can stream to Twitch and in both the chats you can use the task widget, okay? It even supports simulcasting. So let's say, for example, you're simulcasting to both YouTube and Twitch. If any YouTube chats, YouTube chatters want to use it, they can use the task widget from the YouTube chat. If any Twitch chatters want to use the task widget, they can also use from Twitch chat and they both go on the same widget. Okay, so it's also free, easy to set up to use, easy to set up, easy to use, etc. So let's go over the installation. Okay, let me try to make this a quick video. One click on on, the, on this page, click on the green code button and then you download zip. Okay, I'm gonna put it in temporary folder. And the next step is to install Streamerbot. You head over to it, you head over to Streamerbot, downloads, and then you download Streamerbot over here. Well, I already have Streamerbot downloaded, so I'm not gonna go through with it. You have, you can follow some other instruction video on how to like install and set up i'm not gonna go through this instruction video the link to the repository will be in the description below okay you watch this video up until the 4 5 43 timestamp next import the stream bot files okay so before that i'm gonna extract all okay extract all put it here okay and you can find all this Notice that you have the streambot import. That's going to be important for this step where you can go to streambot if you have everything installed and set up. You, sorry for the flashbang. <laughs> so you click on import and import string on in this box. Okay, you're going to want to drag the... It's this one. You want to drag this file into that box. So if I can, all right, I'm going to drag streambot import into this box. It'll have the string right here. And you can see it'll have Twitch task response and YT ta YouTube task response. I'm going to import it. I'm going to get it overwritten. Okay. And that should be it for step four. And on in step five, you go to streambot service client WebSocket, make it look like this, okay? So this is not the default port number from Streamerbot. You go to server's clients, you go to WebSocket server. Well, I already have mine set up. So if you want to edit this, you have to stop the server, okay? You can change this to 6968. Okay, and you're gonna want to start server and then click auto start and that should get it set up and bef and actually i'm gonna delete something cut this out okay now where were we mm, on step six we set up the browser source we check the local file and then we browse to index.html okay i'm gonna turn on studio mode for this and I'll be clicking the plus icon, click on browser, I'm going to demo task, and I'm going to click OK, I'm going to click on local file, I'm going to the folder that I had just now, okay, and click on index, okay, it's going to have a browser icon next to it, okay, and it says index, and you're going to click OK, and that should get it. That should have set up transition and you're able to see it and it's way too bit large. I'm going to minimize it and there you go. Well, for you guys, it probably looks something more like this. 
and you can add a task like you, know, you can add a task like task test uh, task 11 and that will get added okay please uh, please note that for this task widget you can't add multiple incomplete tasks however I do have the multitask widget with streamer bot a streamer bot version of the multitask widget that will be that is currently $30 on my Kofi. the prices may change in the future all right and that is it you have the You have your own task widget set up. Okay, thank you. See you next time. Bye.